Welcome everyone to another exciting SpaceX update video. The Starbase launch site has enjoyed a serene atmosphere over the past few days, with minimal activity aside from tanker trucks delivering cryogenic propellants to the orbital tank farm. Our anticipation for the second Starship flight on the 8th is dwindling due to SpaceX's need to roll out S-25, stack it on top of Booster 9, and perform a final wet dress rehearsal, all of which must happen before launch. As for the FAA launch license, we are still waiting for updates. Do you think a launch next week is still possible, or will it be delayed by a few more weeks? Nevertheless, preparations for this flight are in full swing. SpaceX recently equipped the launch tower with multiple new cameras, including an IMAX cam. It's thrilling to think about what that camera will capture during the launch. Meanwhile, the SpaceX team at Starbase conducted a cleanup operation at the wetlands to address the aftermath of the first Starship flight. Additionally, the fast boat that SpaceX used during the initial IFT to inspect the keepout zone has made its way to Brownsville. Yesterday, SpaceX achieved a significant milestone with its 61st launch of the year. On the third attempt, a Falcon 9 rocket successfully launched 13 military satellites into space from SLC-4E at Vandenberg Space Five, Force Base in California. Four, three, two, one, ignition, and is full power. And the Space Force Agency, 0E, go Falcon, go FTA. Stage 1 propulsion is normal. Remarkably, the first stage booster for this mission completed its 13th flight. Stage 1 landing leg deploy. Stage 1 landing confirmed. Today, SpaceX is set to embark on its record-breaking mission of the year, Starlink 6-12. If successful, this launch will mark SpaceX's 62nd launch of the year, surpassing its own record of 61 launches in 2022. Elon Musk has ambitious plans, aiming for 10 launches per month by the end of this year and an astonishing 12 launches per month next year. SpaceX is truly setting the bar high and leaving other launch companies in the dust. But the excitement doesn't end there. The NASA SpaceX Crew-6 mission has already undocked from the station and is en route to Earth aboard Crew Dragon Endeavor. Splashdown is scheduled for tomorrow off the coast of Jacksonville, Florida, at 12.17 a.m. Eastern Time. We send our best wishes to the SpaceX teams for a successful Starlink mission launch and the safe return of Crew Dragon. That's all for now. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned for more news in the next video.